Hey guys, for today's video, Tate and Lyle have asked me to create a jam recipe to get you inspired to make homemade jam. I think it's such a shame that people don't make it anymore because it's delicious and it really is easy, especially if you use their jam sugar. The flavour possibilities are endless and with the added pectin, you can use a lot more fruits like strawberries and cherries. So you're bound to get a perfect jam every time. So here is how you make my strawberry, apple and elderflower jam. Cause baby, I can help myself. I'm here to do my thing, who knows what tomorrow brings I'm never gonna kiss and tell I just wanna have fun Show me what you got, cause the floor is getting hot I wanna see the way you move It's time to get it on, gonna party all night long This is what we do Now I know there are lots of ways to enjoy jam, but for me, the best way is on a scone with some clotted cream. And I go clotted cream first, then a big dollop of jam. But what do you guys do? Let me know in the comments box below. So I'm gonna get in there. Smells amazing. I think I need to get trying. Cheers. Mm. <laughs> mm. It's a classic strawberry, but the apple and elderflower really complement that flavour. It's amazing. Entries are now open for the Tate and Lyle Great British Jam Awards. I'll leave all of the details in the description box for the competition so you guys can get involved. It's so easy to enter. So that is how you make my strawberry apple and elderflower jam. Easy.